Hello and welcome to this video. In this video we're gonna discuss about how to execute the wget or curl commands on Windows. First let me explain to you that wget or curl commands are commonly used on Linux terminal that doesn't have any graphic interface or they doesn't have any browser installed. They are commonly used to check if a URL is up and running to get content and also to execute web service operation like get or post. This is what curl command does. You can pause the video and read the description if you want or you can use the man utility and run the curl command. You're gonna get all the information on your Linux terminal and all the parameters used to execute this command. Here we get uh, what the wget command does. Uh, once again, if you prefer to read the description, please pause the video. If not, use the man utility against the wget. What is the equivalent of the command curl or wget in Windows? We can use PowerShell to emulate any of those. With the command invoke web request, we can get the same results. Now let's take a look to our command in our PowerShell terminal. Let's use invoke dash web request with the parameter space dash question mark to display all the information of the command. We can see the name, the syntax, and the aliases. The aliases include IWR, WGET, and CURL. That means that we can replace any of these commands with the invoke dash web request. Now let's do a quick test. Let's open the page www.bmc.com. And once that we have fired up the command, uh, we have the status code that is 200 and the status description that is okay. That means the site is up and running. We have after that the content that is HTML type. We have the forms, the headers, and the rest of the information. As I have mentioned before, this command can be used to execute web service operation like post and get, but that part is not covered on this video, will be covered in a future video. Thanks for watching. I hope it results helpful for you and you have enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and to activate the notification so you don't miss any new video. Thank you.